Biff Busick does not get paid by the hour as it's made of end time C4. What's up guys, welcome back, it's Biff. Before we get to the vlog, I wanted to go over some upcoming dates that I have. Saturday, April 30th, I'll be in Atlantic City for GCW. I'm gonna get there a few days early and go to some of the casinos to hopefully film some more content for the vlog, so check that out in the next few weeks. On May 1st, I make my return to Pro Wrestling Guerrilla after about seven years to wrestle Speedball Mike Bailey in Los Angeles. I'm really looking forward to that. On May 13th, I'll make my debut at West Coast Pro in San Francisco. And on May 22nd, I will be having my first ever meetup game at Hustler Casino in Los Angeles. I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, please come on out if you're in the area and play some 1-3 No Limit Texas Hold'em with me. As you saw earlier, I traveled to Ottawa, Canada to wrestle for C4. I wrestled Kevin Koo in a crazy match. It was really fun. He's a really good wrestler. Uh, I really look forward to going back to Ottawa. I really like the fans there. It's a really fun place to work. Uh, from Ottawa, I flew down to Boston, Massachusetts, where I had a day off in between wrestling at Beyond Wrestling in Providence, Rhode Island. On my day off between shows, I traveled to Foxwoods Resort and Casino in Connecticut with my good buddy, The Bulldozer. This is the second time in a few months that me and The Bulldozer got to play some Hold'em together. So uh, let's get to the vlog and uh, check out some hands. The boys are back in town. The Foxwoods get ready. But this is it. Once you turn that corner, boom, there it is. Da -da -da, da -da -da. I felt like it was a life. Driving a little baby car. Da -da -da, da -da -da. All right, first interesting hand we have here at Foxwoods. I'm on the button with King Jack of Clubs. We got a bunch of limpers, so I am going to raise it up to $15. My good friend, the bulldozer, who's sitting to my left in the small blind, is going to make the call. Another player in early position makes the call, and the player directly to my right in the cutoff makes the call. So we are going four ways to a flop. Yep, 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 yep. Flop comes ace five seven two clubs and the bulldozer immediately Whoa. bets out twenty dollars. Uh, the player in early position makes the call. The player to my left in the cutoff folds and when action gets to me, I have a draw to the nuts. I have about a hundred and seventy five dollars behind, so I'm going all in. Let's gamble and see what happens. After going in the tank, the bulldozer makes the call. He shows ace jack for top pair. Let's go to a run out and see how we do. No club, no club, no club. Don't do it to me. And the run out is not good for us. The bulldozer stacks us and uh, Hey, that's poker. We're here to gamble. Let's go to the next hand and see if we can make up to that loss. Okay, bro. That's fucking dying, living dying. This is my girlfriend right here. She's not like Next hand we have a pair of tens in the big blind. A player in early position is going to raise to $12. It's going to fold around to the small blind who is going to make the call. 
and when action gets to me, I'm gonna three bet to forty dollars. Bulldoze is screaming for the bartender, and before I know it, the original Razor four bets me to $125. The player to my right in the small blind folds, and with a pair of 10s here, I think this is a pretty easy call, so I make the call, and we are going heads up to a flop with a pretty juicy pot developing here. Flop is ace, queen, no, six, so and chips, that's pretty yeah, bad for my hand. I am going, going to check the original razor checks as well. The turn is the even worse king of spades, so I'm going to check again. And that's when the original razor makes it about 150 to go, and I'm pretty much just only beating a bluff here. I'm pretty sure he's probably caught some of this board, so unfortunately, I'm gonna have to fold. And uh, yeah, that was a uh, that was a borderline hand with 150 big blinds deep. I think uh, flat calling to a four bet was the right move. Hopefully, we hit a set there some parts of the time, so we get paid off. But this time, unfortunately, we don't, and we lose a pretty good sized pot. I was calling just hoping. Next hand, I'm in early position with King Nine of Spades. I raise it to seven dollars, and the friggin' bulldozer three bets me to fifteen dollars. Uh, the player on the button is gonna make the call. I'm gonna make the call as well. So we are going three ways to a flop. Let's see what the other players do here. If it makes you feel any better, I would have called her. <laughs> well, where was your cards? I already, already folded. It was too late. Flop comes 973 Rainbow. I have top pair here, and when action gets to me, I'm going to check uh, the other player's check as well. Uh, I'm pretty confident I'm good here going into the turn, and I feel even better about my hand when the Queen of Spades comes. That gives me a pair and a flush draw. Here, I am going to bet for value, and I'm going to make a pot size bet to $60. <laughs> You're fucking driving home in the trunk. <laughs> you got a bag of kick out of me? We gotta, you gotta pay to play, let's find out. What'd you bet? 60. You fucking hate you so much. Bulldozer finds a fold and we take down one of the few pots in this session at Foxwoods. Show me what he had! You fucking creep. I'm gonna watch the fucking block. If you beat me, I'll be proud of you, but I'm gonna be mad at the same time. I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad. I gotta take a piss like a racehorse, but I ain't even mad. Alright, so me and the bulldozer both had losing sessions. I was down 352. Bulldozer was only down, I think, like 95 bucks. So, unfortunately, not a winning session, but we still got Encore in Boston in a couple days to look forward to. So, Hopefully we can make up for the losses tonight. I'm waiting for Bulldozer to come out of the bathroom and see if we can see him. Ready? Don't come. Let's go in there. Take care. Bye-bye now.